Well, all right, we'll continue. That weird sign. Did I already rebattle you? I'm pretty sure I did. Eh. eh it's really difficult to talk to you. Right, edge uh, 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 I was so close. Ah! Why? Okay, I've definitely not battled you. Ah! Thank goodness for that. Get lost, kid! I'm bushed! What? Well, you seem so excited to re-battle. Ah, I changed my mind, but it's too late now. Biker William. I've arrived. It's time for some flame throwing. Oh, oh, oh. Alright then. You know, where you caught me, trainer, there were many a coughing in that place. So I'm quite, uh, I'm, uh, I don't mind coughing, personally. Well, that's very nice. We're fiery path friends. Uh, it's, uh, it's slightly nostalgic for me to see. A coffin. But these are Kanto coffee. It's very different, very different. I see. So at the same time, I have no qualms. Flame throwing them into oblivion. Oh yeah. Yes. Can I also say how much I'm enjoying the leftovers? Immensely so. Cool. Yes, I think it's cool. Yes. Which is ironic because I'm all about the heat. Uh. Yes, so very funny. Pretty sure these wheezings are illegal. Yes, they, they very much are. Shut up about my illegal wheezing. Don't ask me how I obtained them. Are you satisfied? Are you satisfied with an easy ride? Stop. I need to catch a few Zs. A few Zs. Whatever. I say Z. I used to say Z. So I really don't care either way. Pretty sure I've already been here. Yeah, I have. Well, that's the end of that. Eh. Cycling road slope ends here. Well, technically here, but okay. Route 18. You're not allowed to get off your bike, so you can't go surfing, which is a bit sad. Cycling road. No pedestrians permitted! Seems awful, but okay. I guess roads aren't meant to be walked on, so it's like a freeway. You can't just walk on the freeway. Cycling road is uh, all uphill from here. Why would you ever come from this side? I don't know. Let's go heal before we go over there. Actually, I might switch some Pokemon out. Patricia's like well overdue to be switched out. Oh. It is true, I'm now level 50, so. Indeed. Why not? One psychic type for another. Clarabelle. That's all we're going to switch for now. Put Clarabelle in front. Well, 
It's a pleasure to be here. I'm Clarabelle. I never talked just as most of us in Ruby, but we're all we're all really speaking up now, aren't we? Yes, it seems that way now. Oh, only one of you let the team down. I warned you before, this is my turf. I don't want you coming around. Hurtful. This patch of grass is precious to me. I'm a bird keeper. Bird keeper Jacob. Whoa, level 47. Am I sure I should be doing this? Oh, I have Thunderbolt. I should be okay. Laughable damage. <laughs> I bet this Fero is very upset that I know Thunderbolt. No doubt. I might as well use it again. I don't think that will serve you very well. Your special attack leaves something to be desired. Am I right? That's why Pursuit was so bad. Ha <laughs> It is fine though. Can be forgiven for your bad stress. Clarabelle, you're quite the savage. Well, you know. They thought they knew what they were doing. And they proved they did not. What else is there to say? To be honest, it's very difficult to fill the void. Fill the void, you know, of silence. If it weren't for the music and the sound effects, it would just be in complete silence at once. That's no good. You can't have dead air. Okay, fair enough. But I will comment that it's quite difficult to, to fill that silence. Anyway, yay. Yes. Well, you've done, you've done your bit. I think it's time for. Um, dare we put in Jemima when she's weak to flying? I trust her defenses. I think I can take it. I really do. And I'm faster too. Oh no. Ah! Well done on surviving. Yeah, I am gonna Thunderbolt again just because, on principle. Okay, trainer, that was probably regrettable that you did that. But, you know, you came through with the goods. I did, I did. I think I'm a lot better equipped to handle this. Nice beam. Hm. I'm not going anywhere. I'm here. Here for good. Ironic that I say that because I've hardly made any appearances here in Kanto. All of you guys sound the same. Pretty much. Done! Oh, my turf is under threat. This is my fave area for catching Pokemon. I love that he says fave. And I'm pretty sure he says that in Gen 1 as well. It's just so refreshing. <laughs> for some reason. Moo Moo Milk time! I'll be standing right back here. I'll come up a little bit. Coming up to... Coming up towards the trainer made my eyes look a bit weird. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. Yoy! Like my... I would say my uh, left eye, but technically it's my right eye because I'm me saying this. It goes a bit weird. That's cool, Jemima, really cool. I, I felt it was worth mentioning, okay. Still got Clarabelle in front? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Is my bird call getting better? <laughs> I don't know what it was like before. 
Also, my rendition might have sucked. Bird Keeper. Ramiro. Dodrio. Dodrio is really powerful. I'm actually a little scared. Bazira zero zero zero. Psych, it's all fine. I mean, I was against a level 47 thing last time. I had to bug you! Ah. To collect C. Uh, I collect C Pokemon on weekends because the C is so close. It's just there. We're literally there. Yum, 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 yum. Good. I've been checking every grassy area for new Pokemon. But it's not always easy. When you say that, do you mean you actually went beyond here? Because there's only that one patch here. Not gonna answer that. Birdkeeper will. Sparrow, huh? Well, I think that's within doable range. That was quick and painless, I'm sure. Ah, Firo. The first opponent I faced in Kanto, but a few minutes ago. I can already feel a little nostalgic about it. How nice. You really do speak some utter garbage, Clarabelle. Well, chitch. My thoughts exactly. I wish I had a bike. Why didn't the first, like, why didn't you do that the first time we faced off against each other? Because I'm a bad trainer, okay? I don't know what I'm doing half the time, but I managed to get my Fearos up to level 47. I leveled up off screen, it was lovely. Yes! I leveled up very much on screen, which is also very lovely. I bet. Ram bam bam, ram bam bam bam. Can I take this out in one? That is the question. This time. Right, last time it might have been minimum damage, who knows? No, sadly, that is not how it worked. Oh, good. We could be alright here. Yep. Easily. I'm even gonna try to cover it. Even though I know you're not holding anything. Okay, bye. Also, I might already be holding something. Ah, oh, I think it's time for me to make an appearance. Oh, how novel. No. I mean, it didn't mean much to me, but oh, it seems too intense. I can't handle it. But I can at the same time. Oh, oh, it's all gonna be fine. It was foolish enough to use mirror move, but I think I would have been fine with another drill pack. Meh. Yes. Huh. 
Um, Stanislaus. I'm handling a Fero, am I? Okay, whatever. Oh, roast it up. It's funny that leftovers is like depicted as an apple core. I always depicted it myself as something like ready. <laughs> That's great, really great. Done. It's a pretty good area. Pretty sure it does. You can catch Doji over. Ram bam ba da 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 ding. Bam, bam, bam. All right, I just basically rearranged Pokemon in boxes. Nothing happened to the party, so there you go. I am just going to have Cadence fly us to Lavender Town after all that. Because no, I don't want to go uh, south to north on this other route. I want to go north to south. That's what we're going to do. Amsterdam. North to Lavender. You just came from there. There's a uh, lookout spot upstairs. The view is magnificent. Pokemon Tower. There's a man fishing. There's several. A TM27 is move called Return. <laughs> if you treat your Pokemon good, it will return your love by working its hardest in battle. I like I like the move return. One day I will get through that door. There we go. <laughs> Ah, they also put their hands up. Yeah, I got a bird here. This might be the real thing. Whoa! They look so dejected. Yeah, I'm pretty dejected most of the time. You know, I thought I caught something great, then it's a golden. You know, stuff like that gets to you after a while. Especially when it's uh, handled that easily by opponents. Yeah. You can see how that would be uh, discouraging. I'm plowing through this team, but that is to be expected. I occasionally lose my certain voice. I need to keep it in check. Those are unique problems to you, Clarabelle. Actually, they're not. Chit, just a small fry. Hmm. All right then. Hang on, my line's snagged. Hang on for what? I don't know. You're finally here. Fishing is a wedding game. <laughs> Fisherman chip. Fish and chips. Mm. No. All right then. I'm gonna go psychic just because, you know, for once it actually is super effective. Even though it just so happens to also be a water type. You don't have to justify every move, Clarabelle. And also, I'm the one commanding you to do it. Yes, but I like to imagine that I'm doing this as a Pokemon all on my own. Okay. Well, that's fine, too. That one got away! The one that got away. 
With a better rod, I could catch better Pokemon. That may also be true. Disappointment. Can you stop doing that? I'm right next to you. You really should oblige. No. Well, I'm pretty sure I just heard a weeping bell in the grass. Thank you. Yeah, okay, fine. The Fishing Fool versus the Pokemon Kid. Another round. Fight! You see, you're really into it. I don't know why you held out so long. Oh, I needed more time to prepare. Fisherman Hank. More time to prepare my level 27 Goldeen. And oh, looks like I'm screwed. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, uh, I am the fishing fool after all. Uh. I take no prisoners. Touch too much! Yes. 13 levels too much. I guess you get to be good at what you like. Well, you beat me at Pokemon, but you can't top me at fishing. I respect that. At least he wants to battle. Ignore the uh, couple over there. I love fishing, don't get me wrong, but I wish I had more work. It's hard to give up fishing. Fisherman Elliot, sorry I'm just trying to figure out what he means. But I don't think I will ever, I think it was just very weirdly phrased. Does anyone else agree that Cloister's being an ice type is so random? Just me? Do That's how Cedra used to um That's how it's called cool, was in the anime. I I R C. It's kind of like um Victory Bell. Like just making a random noise, which I actually prefer because that's more true to the games. Anyway. It's not easy. I'm just I'm not a fan of them just saying their names for literally every Pokemon most of the time. It's snag. Nah. It's alright. Losing doesn't bug me anymore. There are certain calls that are so, like, adorbs. And then when I see them in the anime without those calls, I'm like, no way. Anyway, that could just be me. I think there are other people who feel similar. Similarly. Do you want a battle yet? Ugh, goodness sake. Typical. Sport fishing area. I noticed that. Okay, now they want to go. I'll win here today and propose to my Gia. Gia. Young couple, Gia and Jess, Nitta King and Nitta Queen. Oh, I was not prepared for this. Oh, trainer. Oh, you've sold us up the river again. I didn't mean to. <laughs> this happens so, like, suddenly. Luckily, it's chosen to double kick a psychic type, so... That's one turn out of the way that we didn't have to worry about. 
But I made short work of it with that. Now if uh, Stanislas can just finish it off. Who's it doing superpower on from Stanislas? Oh dear. Well, it appears this young couple know nothing about what they're doing. This works out very well for us. It does. We're very lucky. <laughs> Because, you know, if one of them had Earthquake, take, well, mate, one of them could have used Protect while the other used Earthquake, Stanislaus would be gone, pretty sure. Although his defense is pretty good, but nah, not the same type of attack bonus powered Earthquake. I don't think he could withstand that. Anyway, what? Clarabelle's trying to learn Future Sight. Nah, not a goer. Fine, whatever. Hang on, guys. Okay. We had to interrupt everything for that. Yes. Not as upset as I was to see Nido Queen and Nido King. I am very enamored with Nido Queen. It's a second tier fave of mine. Nido King is okay, but I just I like Nido Queen more. I like quite a lot more. Probably because it's got better defense or something. Which is usually the case with the male female things. Meow Stick is one example of the opposite being the case. The male being the more defensive. Cool. Yes. No, oh, please, why couldn't you just let us win? Oh. oh, Gia, forgive me, my love. Just you silly. You ruined this. <laughs> it's all on you. Now I want to know what her quotes were. Nah. May have to try to get them to battle again. Now I can absorb water if I want to. I can absorb water if I want to. Sorry, what? Alright, I'll tell you what. We'll go and heal in Vermilion City. We'll walk there so that we get the uh, steps for the uh, Versus Seeker without actually having to run around on the spot, you know? I mean, I could have just flown to Vermilion and walked back. That would have easily been enough steps. But anyway, we're here now. I basically have this criteria now. Like I was looking at those others that were on the team earlier. You know, the likes of Cray Cray and uh, Antimony and Misery Guts. They were all like level 45 or 46 when they were ousted from the team. So I'm like, well, if anyone gets to about that level and has had lots of screen time, that's pretty much when they have to leave the team. That's sad, but that's how it has to be. Don't want to have double standards. Oh, for goodness sake, guys. Alright. I can't walk past a battle. Especially this guy, because he's actually got lots of Pokemon and you get quite a few levels out of them. Well, not levels, but you know what I mean. Quite a lot of experience out of them. Oh, for goodness sake. You bought yourself one turn. Great. Great. Are you really proud? It's just like... Yeah. I win in the smallest way possible. Thank you. Hey Jess, <laughs> I've been waiting a long time now. If we win today, I'll marry you. It's that simple. I think I want to marry you. Stupid song. <laughs> Trust 
Trainer, did you forget the mons that they had? Yes, now... Uh, let's just get on with this. Hopefully they'll be stupid like last time. Hopefully. Oh, I knocked it out in one hit. It's all fine. It was a crit. More double kicking of a psychic type. Embarrassing as anticipated. I mean, you don't have to be quite so harsh. Uh, cruel but fair, you know. Silly, you've ruined this. And now you know what my aforementioned thoughts were about. Or oh, whatever. Right. Because that makes sense. There's a person who gives you a fishing rod. Hello there, Louie. Have you been fishing? Try fishing with the super rod in any body of water. You'll find different Pokemon in different places. Oh, and don't forget to bring me gigantic magic up. Do you actually give me something if I do? Ah. Did not know about that. It's an added thing in Gen 3. Hi. I'm gonna try to battle you. Excuse me, just running here. He's actually just walking around because look. He's not running at all. Good. Electricity has always been my specialty. I don't know a thing about Pokemon of the Sea, though. <laughs> Here we go. Rockaluka! I thought these guys only ever appeared in Lieutenant Surge's gym. But maybe in Gen 3. They, uh, ventured out of there. Why am I thunderbolting it? Train! Ah! Uh, pay attention. Sorry. I was too busy thinking about the rocker trainer class. Yes. Seems you were. The ironic thing is, a second thunderbolt then would have knocked it out. Yes, but that's not the point. Ram, bam, bam, bam. It's time for me to earthquake something. I can hardly contain myself. I love to use my main move and all. 20 HP was stolen. Well, it's not stolen, but okay. Just take it. It was removed. Unplugged. Water conducts electricity, so you should zap sea Pokemon, yes. You can't zap me. Well, you're not really a sea Pokemon. Ah. You are a freshwater d dwelling Pokemon. I see. Terence, you need to be in front. You're lagging behind. Yeah, I noticed that. It's a bit troubling. Stupid country. No, no one deserves to have cut thrust upon them. I'm still not learning it. I'm just gonna have to let that person languish there forever. <laughs> Why did they choose to set themselves up behind a cut tree anyway? That was a foolish decision on their part. Ah. Uh... Crossed into Route 13. Ugh. No! Ugh. Damn it. Well, I just wanna say 
I didn't want to batter you anyway. But I do. I do want to batter you. So. Damn it. Be nice. Nah. Not doing it. Cool. Thank you. What's Gurchin? You'll never know unless you beat me. Or I could just fish. No, no. I wouldn't hear about Fisherman Andrew. Fake how? Whoa. Gotcha. But I think I'll uh, have to smelling salt for this one. You do that. <laughs> Magic Carp was very alert and then it fainted. Lost it! That you did. What? Magic Carp? I catch them all the time, sure. But boy, are they wimpy. They go on about it so much. Even though, like, Gyarados is so, like, commonly found in like any more advanced places it's just like it's so clear that magic cover evolves into it they just still play up that it's a useless pokemon yeah i cleaned out my savings and bought more carbos this npc in gen 1 is one of my absolute faves just for the simplicity of their introductory quote anyway picnic at alma yes as a battle greeting she says i found carbos in a cave once ding -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a. <laughs> like what We've all found Carbos in a cave, alright? You don't need to go on about it. At least it will use it as a battle introduction. So, but it, no, it's not just the player character who walks around finding these random things on the ground. You gotta wonder about some of the items you find, like, who left it there? Were they really that careless? Or is it like a geocache? Oh, too bad. I just messed up. Ah. Carbos boosted the speed of my Pokemon. That is what it does. I want to be the best trainer while I'm a kid. I'm uh, being very ambitious. Don't let the dream die. Picnic of Susie. Oh, oh, I don't know about facing flying types, but I do have fake outs. So. I think it's doable. I don't know how you were alarmed, even though it's 15 levels underneath. Well. This is more my style. <laughs> but I'm annoyed because the only fighting move I have is a uh, low priority move. Didn't you have the Brick Break TM? Oh yeah. Could I have it? I think you could. I think you could. Considering it's a viable TM. Which I'm just so thrilled about. Considering I forgot that it was. Poor Raticate used its one turn to miss. Yes. I'm coming and tangled the Pikachu. I could have done it. No, no. This is my job. And I wouldn't have it any other way. I predict an earthquake up in here. Oh, don't, don't sing up my fields. Why not? It's pertinent. I might as well stay in to do this too. Oh, 
love laugh. No, oh, I lost. Sometimes that's all you can say when you lose. I want to become a good trainer. I'll train hard. Just watch. Good attitude. So, Brick Break TM. We get to see the uh, TM thing happen. That will be funny. Jemima can learn it? That's so random. Smelling salt cures paralysis, that's interesting. In return, it will not miss. Um, does that actually apply to... Um, screw it, we can always hard scale it back on if we really need to. Machine set! Slam this CD into your head. Dong! Nice. Pretty sure Vital Throw can't miss. If it says 100 accuracy, that means it can miss, right? I'll have to look that up. Ah! Wow! You got more cool badges! I have all of them, so... Yeah, whatever. I wonder if you re-battled her immediately after the first time we battled her. Well, she would have to say the same thing. They wouldn't have different text for her. Don't! Because that was so, like... You were so doomed. It was just annoying. I hate things that last that long. Not enough! Uh, not enough double slaps! We got those badges from gym leaders, I know! Great knowledge. Oh, you're back! <laughs> Didn't think I'd ever see your sorry face here again. Sure, I'll play with you again, sweetie. <laughs> Sinister. <laughs> Beauty Lola. Lola. Fake hell. Of course, I can't not. Oh, but now I have to actually use a contact move on Pikachu. That's not good. Zero, zero, zero. Oh, it's still great to use Brick Break for the first time. Ah, nice. Oh, of course, oh, of course. If only smelling salt could snap me out of paralysis, too. It is what it is. For some reason, I'm coming up to do this last ratata. Fine with it. Let's up quick. You little beast! If that's what you want to say. I wonder which is stronger, male or female Pokemon? Well, you know, in my opinion, a lot of the time, it's actually the female Pokemon, because I just prefer their defensive power, because it's what I was going on about before. And also just, I don't know, the dynamic is... It's cooler to me. That's why Kangaskhan is one of my absolute, you know, they, well... It's a second tier fave of mine. Miltank is a top tier fave. Which is also a female only Pokemon. Although I do also like Taurus. My bird Pokemon, remember you! Should I be worried? Yes. Bird Keeper Sebastian. I should be worried about a Pidgey. Oh, it's a level 29! Oh, I see. Quite advanced Pokemon. 
Yes, but I also forgot to heal my own paralysis. Oh, he broke through. And I'm guts powered up. There's no way you would survive. I don't think it would anyway, but yeah. Let's have Clarabelle close this battle. I'm calling it, guys. It's over. I even traced its keen eye. I'm now projecting I will be the victor of this battle. And I am. It didn't take much to foresee that. It didn't even need my psychic abilities. My Pidgey and Pidgeotto combo lost? You're surprised by that? My Pokemon look happy even though they lost. Well, that's nice. And once again, I forgot to heal Terence's paralysis. Seriously, Trainer, you had one job in between. I know, and I'm sorry. Still managed to fake out. Nine hundred and ninety-nine. Yes. Oh, too bad. I just messed up. Oh, da -de -da -de -de. Well, Gardevoir, i.e. Clarabelle, has leveled up again. Let's just go back to the million to heal and I will also wrap up the episode what an uneventful time it's been but anyway it's been nice to have uh, Clarabelle on the team and I think she'll be retired from the team already because she's already at level 45 and she got heaps and heaps of airtime today so that was nice. Nice for me. Nice for me. But it sucks that I'll be ousted from the team. Yes. Anyway. Thanks for watching somehow. See you soon. Ish.